Derby Day, just a few days away here at Batavia Downs. I'm here with Todd Height, uh, General Manager of Live Racing. Todd, obviously a big day here at the Downs. Uh, although the, uh, the favorite was scratched, uh, a lot of excitement still uh, surrounding this race. Uh, what's your overall outlook on just the race overall this weekend? Well, the Kentucky Derby is our biggest day of the year at OTB. And we'll take in over $2 million in bets, and the Kentucky Derby alone will pay back about $1.8 million in winning bets. And it's certainly very exciting for everyone in the racing industry, and uh, it is the first leg of the Triple Crown, which is very historic, and we're looking for a great day. Now, uh, you, you do have a party here set up downstairs, I believe, on Saturday. Uh, tell us a little bit about that. Oh, we have actually uh, three parties. We have one party at Thurman's 34 Rush Sports Bar, which uh, just come in and enjoy a cocktail and watch the race on those big screens. We have our $75 gala upstairs on the second floor. Uh, that's a great deal as well. You get $25 back in free play. You get a $10 bet on the Kentucky Derby, an open bar for two and a half hours, mm. and, and a buffet. Sensational deal. And then downstairs, we have our annual a party in the uh, Park Place uh, Event Center, and that's a $20 deal, and you'll get $15 back in free play. You'll get a $5 wager on the Kentucky Derby. You'll get a Kentucky Derby glass, which... Yep. Well, it, I've, it, I've already seen them. They're nice. And, and, and a T-shirt as well with a nice little Star Wars quote on the back, so make sure you get one of those. Right, and also uh, you'll get a choice of five food items. So it's a $35 uh, uh, deal for just $20. No reservations. We don't take reservations. First come, first serve. That starts at 11 11:30. So uh, get her early. You'll be insured to, to get the deal. Now betting opens uh, tomorrow at 10 a.m. Uh, here at Batavia Downs. Now, when it comes to the race, like I said, the favorite was scratched, Omaha Beach. Uh, how do you think that plays into uh, what might take place on Saturday? Well, it does change the race a little bit, the complexion of the race, because Omaha Beach had speed. Mm -hmm. And so now the early leader, probably maximum security, will not be pushed as much, and that should enhance his chances. So if you like maximum security a little bit with Omaha Beach in there, you got to like his chances a little bit better. Now, the great equalizer, however, is the racetrack. 100% uh, chance of rain yep. uh, could certainly affect the, the track, uh, the way it plays. Is, if it's sloppy, uh, the speed horses should carry. If it's very muddy and gooey, that's going to tire out the early leaders, and here come the horses from the back of the field. So really and truly, we'll just have to see what happens with the racetrack. Now, obviously, Bob Baffert, uh, always a big storyline heading into the Derby. He, he His horses have won two out of the last four Derbies, I believe. He has three horses uh, in this year's race, uh, Improbable, Game Winner, and Roadster. Uh, obviously, you got to take him into account. Uh, what do you see from him, his horses this weekend? Yeah, they're all very, very good horses. Game Winner is now the morning line favorite. He was the two-year-old champion. Improbable is knocking down the barn. He feels so good in his workouts that he just wants to run all day. And then, of course, Roadster, the Santa Anita Derby, he had a winner. He had throat surgery, and since he's had that throat surgery, he hasn't lost. So uh, Bob Baffert is sending out a trifecta of very good horses, and either or any could win this race. Now, I got to ask you, Todd, you know, a lot of, you know a lot more about this than I do. Who's your favorite to win the race? Well, I did pick number 16 game winner just because how consistent he is. He's bred to handle an off racetrack, Bob Baffert. But uh, there are at least eight horses that can win this race, which makes it a great opportunity uh, for people watching us to come to OTB starting tomorrow, make a wager. There's very few horses that are bad horses to bet. Uh, maybe some of those 30 and 50 to one shots I'd stay away from. But if you see any horses from 15 to one down, that horse has a chance to win this race. How about any special bets, any trifecta, anything like that that you see that uh, that you might like this this uh, this coming year? Well, I did give out my annual Superfecta bet. It's right on the front of the OTB program. We got lucky a few years ago and hit that with American Pharaoh. Uh, not sure we're going to hit it this year because it's a, a wide, <laughs> wide open, open. race. There's so much parity in this race that it's unbelievable. But uh, right on the front of the OTB program, we have the pick. I think it's 16, 8, 7, and 5. And then also, we give out a $1 exact a box, which we've been very successful successful on throughout the years and those numbers are and I'm I'm gonna to have to remember this off memory but it's three uh, five seven eight sixteen I believe is the right numbers here let me just double check that but I believe I'm right there yes three five seven eight sixteen three five seven eight sixteen that's a one dollar exact a box so starting tomorrow when the OTB branches and right here at the racetrack the simulcast center open at 10 a.m. just go to the window and say I want a one dollar box and those five horses it will cost you twenty dollars you get a lot of action for twenty dollars don't say you want a twenty dollar bet because that'll cost you four hundred <laughs> so make sure you say one dollar and again if we can get 
lucky and the three horse wins and the eight comes second, you're looking at a four or $500 exacta, you'll get half of that. So not a bad investment on a $20 bet. Now, t uh, tell me from experience, Todd, how crazy does it get inside the Downs uh, on Derby Day? Well, uh, last year we had 605 people attend our downstairs party. Uh, our gala, we had over 200 people attend. 34 rush is standing room only, so we'll get about 1,200 people here just to bet the Kentucky Derby, just on those three parties. And then, of course, here all day long starting at 10 o'clock, you'll see people up and down this highway. So, uh, like I say, we do take in $2 million in betting throughout our entire West Western Regional Off-Track Betting Corporation. It's a huge day. It's our Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. We're geared up. We're ready. And we just need to see who's the winner. Now, final question. Uh, as you continue to make improvements to the downs, both inside and the exterior, uh, how exciting is it year by year to just continue to welcome people and continue to show off what's become kind of a gem of Batavia? Well, it, for me, it's amazing because I was here in 1973, and none of this was here. It was just harness racing, and now we have so much more with great food, uh, our, our gaming machines, horse racing, our event centers, our concerts. There's so much going on here. I can't believe the changes. I walk in the door every day, and I, I, I'm just amazed myself. All right, thanks a lot. Todd Height, uh, General Manager of Live Racing here at Batavia Downs. My name's Alex Brasky with the Batavia Daily Dunes. Uh, make sure to stop down here on Saturday to enjoy Derby Day.